Frank Seppi for NPC News Online here at the NPC Photo Gym in Pittsburgh with IFB Bikini Pro, Alexandria Ross, and Fitness oh. Olympia, Whitney Jones. What's up? So now you're with Team Pro Physique, so I'm going to give the mic to Whitney <laughs> to ask, how did her prep go? <laughs> well, let's see, Alex. No. <laughs> So tell us about your prep, because you've, you've had, what, is this your fourth show in five weeks? Yeah. So how are you doing this? Please tell. I am doing great. Um, do I hold this? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, like, sorry. Uh. Um, my prep is going wonderfully. Um, just getting started was kind of the hard part, but I feel like once your body gets going, mm -hmm. it's just, you just roll into it. And um, I feel like every show just keeps getting better and better, and I'm, I'm loving it. So, so you're yeah. building confidence too as you go along, right? Yes, you, that is something I've definitely been working on. So I know your first pro show, you probably had a lot of butterflies, right? You won the nationals. Yes. We were there for that. Yes, that was awesome. And now your first pro show, you have the butterflies. Are they still there? Are you nervous? Um, I have butterflies. I'm excited. Yeah. I'm just here for it. Um, yeah, obviously you always get a little nerves, but I think it's kind of excited nerves. So I'm, I'm excited. <laughs> How did you change her training and nutrition for from the nationals to, you know, the IFBB stage? Well, I will say that Damien had to step in significantly and put her through a lot of the training because she likes to overdo it. So believe it or not, a lot of the training was him saying, all right, we're done. And sometimes the workouts were 15 minutes and it drove her crazy. But um, Something tells me she snuck back in the gym at night. <laughs> I, train. Did. I did. I followed orders as he told me to do. But that's, I think, the most interesting part is I realized I was doing a lot more than I think I needed to be doing. And so having him strategize and cut back on a lot of that really helped me advance and make the changes I needed to. So It's tough. Some competitors will do cardio three times a day. Yeah. And it's hard to get them out of that mode. And, you know, less is more sometimes, you know. Well, and also coming from the amateur ranks to the pro level, she needed to put on some muscle. And when you're overtraining, you're just burning it away and wasting it away. So to really come out and make a name for herself like she has already at the pro ranks, she needed to put on some size, have some fullness, and it was cutting back big time. Yep. And what about your posing? Has it changed from the amateur stage to the pro stage? Yes. I um, have a whole new routine, and that's something that I work on little by little. Every single show, I add something in just a little bit more just to spice it up, jazz yeah. it up, um, <laughs> and just get more comfortable with it. But, yeah. How did you initially get involved in NPC? What motivated you, motivated you to compete? Okay, so I actually started in 2013, mm -hmm. um, and I just remember looking at the girls. My aunt used to be in bodybuilding before they even had oh, wow. hair and all that, and I just remember she always was like, if you can't be supermodel skinny, you can be strong, and I remember her telling me that, and I'm like, I want to be strong, um, and I remember seeing like Natalia Mella, like I, I loved her, and Amanda, and I really just wanted to achieve something like that. And so um, that's kind of how I started. And I started at Pro Physiques as a client. Mm -hmm. um, and then I just never left. Like, I, just, I stuck with them. Why would you? No, and exactly. She's and she's now I'm a coach, coach there. Fun. And I, I love it. I do. I love having a goal. And I love, I love the way the sport changes and the look changes and kind of how it's evolved. I just love it. What do you think sets her physique aside from other competitors? Just, I mean, I think it's, that's tough. I think one of the biggest things that she has working in her favor is she has a very good overall look. The whole package is complete, in my opinion. Um, obviously, I'm a little biased, but it's not just about having the physique. You, you've got to have the stage presence. You've got to have a pretty face. Like, everything has to work together to really be at the top. And she's worked hard to get the physique where it needs to be, and then she's just naturally, she's gorgeous. I mean, look at her. Um, <laughs> and humble, which is really cool to see in this sport. You had a comment? Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I'm ready to Yeah, she, she doesn't take compliments well. It just always embarrasses her. But yeah, just putting in the work. And honestly, I do have to say, because so many NPC athletes think, I'm going to go to the national stage and I'm going to get my pro card. This is a true testament of putting in the work year after year. How many national shows was it? I did about eight national shows. Wow. Yes, and so it takes work. But now she's killing it on the pro stage. So. All of those experiences on the national stage has prepared her to be where she's at as a pro athlete. What's the plan? How many shows is she going to do this year? This is her fifth? Yeah. This is my, this is, wait, no, this will be my fourth. Uh, fourth um, five, yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We're going to just take it 
we going can on tour. See how my yeah, body does. Tour, yeah. And yeah why not? <laughs> yes. Well, with bikini, they have to chase for points. So it's yeah. it's tough. You can't ever just rest and settle. It's like if you're pushing to get to that Olympia stage, it's it's work. Show after show. Well, that's how you know you're the best of the best. That's right. Yeah, <laughs> that's for sure. Right. So that's the goal to get there. And I don't know. I guess we'll have to kind of see. <laughs> Is there anyone you want to thank? Um, I would love to thank everybody here, um, my team, family, friends, my dogs. <laughs> I mean, what are their names? <laughs> Walter. Um, just, yeah, everybody. I mean, everybody at the gym is so fabulous. They're like my gym family, my, my work wife. Yeah. I mean, everybody. Everybody here is just great. So, yes, thank you for this opportunity. Thank you. And how do people get in touch with you on Instagram? Or do you want them to? Oh, absolutely, yes. yes, yes. If you like funny stuff, she's good to follow. She's um, hilarious. My Instagram is Alexandria Ross, just my name, Alexandria Ross. Mm -hmm. well, thank you so much for taking the time, and we wish you a lot of luck tomorrow. Thank you. All right, this is Frank Seppi for NPC News Online.